ہاسپٹل سے دوسری جانیوں کو لے چلیں گے شالی مر اسپتال جہاں پر جدید ریڈ کا افتتاح کر دیا گیا ہے میں ان کے لیے بھلائی ہے اور اور آخرت کا گھر بھی ان کے لیے بہتر ہے اور بہت ہی عمدہ ہے پرہیزگاروں کا گھر ان کے لیے ہمیشہ رہنے والے باغ ہیں جن میں وہ داخل ہوں گے رواں ہوں گی ان کے نیچے نہریں ان کے لیے وہاں ہر وہ چیز ہوگی جس کی وہ خواہش کریں گے یوں بدلہ دیتا ہے اللہ تعالیٰ پرہیزگاروں کو وہ متقی جن کی روحیں فرشتے قبض کرتے ہیں اس حال میں کہ وہ خوش ہوتے ہیں اس وقت فرشتے کہتے ہیں اے نیک بختو سلامتی ہو تم پر داخل ہو جاؤ جنت میں اس نیک عمل کے باعث جو تم کرتے تھے واخر دعوی یا ان الحمد للہ رب العالمین Shalmar Radiology Center is the new state-of-the-art diagnostic and interventional radiology department of Shalmar Hospital. It is the flagship project of Businessman Hospital Trust and essentially a milestone achieved by the Shalmar Institute of Health Sciences. It reflects the ideology of the chairman, BOT, and its trustees enjoying the full tangible support of BOT in all aspects. To reflect on this further, I would now request Brigadier Retired Anis Ahmed, the Chief Executive, Shalamar Institute of Health Sciences, to kindly apprise the honorable guests about the progress made in recent years and our ongoing modernization efforts at Shalamar Hospital. Brigadier Anisa. بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم دس از مائی اٹس مائی پریولیج ونس اگین ٹو ویلکم ویری وارملی ویلکم ایوری ون آن بہاف آف بورڈ آف ٹرسٹیز ایز ویل ایز آن بہاف آف مینجمنٹ آف شالہ مار انسٹیٹیوٹ آف ہیلتھ سائنسز انفارچونیٹلی چودھری ایم ایس سعید از لٹل آن ویل اور ہی ہم سیلف وڈ ہیو been here and uh, welcoming the distinguished guests on behalf of the Businessman Hospital Trust. As mentioned by the general manager, uh, marketing today happens to be a, an extremely auspicious day for Businessman Hospital Trust as well as for Chalamar Hospital. We have uh, achieved yet another milestone in our long journey of love and compassion for the poor and needy. The journey of hospital, Businessman Hospital Trust and that of Shalamar Hospital spread over more than three decades has been nothing but a labor of love and compassion for the poor and needy. Millions have benefited over the decades from the services of Shalamar Hospital from a 50-bed hospital with only six basic departments in the mid-80s, the hospital has blossomed into a 500-bed tertiary care teaching hospital. With God's grace, it now comprises 23 departments covering almost all major specialities. More than half a million patients had visited during 2016 and benefited from the hospital services. Over two, rupees 266 million was spent on providing free and subsidized care to the deserving patients. Shalamar Hospital now, Alhamdulillah, offers all essential health care facilities under one roof. Presently, Shalamar Institute of Health Sciences is one of the biggest health care institutions in the non-profit 
private sector in the city, comprising Shalamar Hospital, Shalamar Medical and Dental College, Shalamar Nursing College, and Shalamar School of Allied Health Sciences. This has been possible only due to a sincere commitment and an untiring endeavor by the trustees of the Businessman Hospital Trust over decades. And this unwavering commitment continues now under the stewardship of Shaudhri MSA, the current chairman of Businessman Hospital Trust, and of course, patronage of one of our founding trustees, Honorable Chaudhry, Chaudhry, Sayyid Babarami. I must also acknowledge the tremendous support which has been extended by the government of Punjab and a large number of donors during this long journey. Our recent emphasis has been on establishing certain centers of excellence. First in the series was CIDR, which dealt with diabetes and endocrine research. And then we came up with Shalamar Clinic for gastroenterology and liver we are now in the process of establishing two more centers of excellence pertaining to chest and uh, chest diseases and asthma, and one uh, concerning urology. Our new radiology center, for whose inauguration we've gathered today, is part of this continuous endeavor to seek excellence as well as modernization. Shalamar Radiology Center is a most modern diagnostic facility comparable to the best in the country. More about it shall be said by Director of Clinical Radiology, Shalamar Hospital, Dr. Zahir Anjam Shirazi, who is a highly competent fellow of Royal College of Radiologists, UK, and a certified interventional radiologist. All modern diagnostic machines like MRI, CT scan, fluoroscopy, mammogram, digital X-rays, and five-color Doppler ultrasound have been placed under one roof and provide an excellent diagnostic facility to the patients. The project has been completed at a cost of over rupees 300 million. I would be amiss in my duty as Chief Executive Shalamar Institute of Health Sciences if I failed to express our profound thanks to Mr. Shahid Hussain, a trustee who personally supervised this project. I would also like to acknowledge the hard work and devotion of all those personnel who have worked tirelessly to complete this complex project. The list includes an array of people across various departments. It would be difficult to me, for me to name all of them. However, I am personally thankful to all of them. Without any further ado, I now hand, over, hand you over to Dr. Zahir Anjam Shirazi for a comprehensive briefing on the newly established radiology center, Dr. Shirazi. Thank you, Brigadier Anisha. In its perpetual strive of excellence, the Shalamar Institute of Health Sciences has always focused on achieving the highest benchmark standards in healthcare. And this radiology center is one of them. To apprise us on this project, I would now request Dr. Zahir Ahmed Shahrazi, Clinical Director, SRC, for his presentation on this project. Mr. Shahrazi. Good morning to everyone. I would like to welcome Sayyid Baba Ali Shahid Hussain, Principal, Shalomar Medical College, Brigadier Anis, distinguished guests, my colleagues here, uh, to this occasion of uh, opening ceremony of official opening ceremony of Shalomar Radiology Center. Although we've been working for a few weeks now, uh, this is uh, an honor for me to be part of this project, which has been completed over a period of uh, 16 months under the guidance of uh, Mr. Shahid Hussain, chairman and uh, trustees of this board. Once they are registered, we have all the information in radiology. 
while reporting. And we have VR reporting system, which is voice recognition system, where we dictate to computers. We don't need assistant. We don't need to change the reports. It goes directly onto the computer, and we are all practicing that in radiology, which is worldwide recognized technique. Again, we want to offer high quality diagnostic and intervention services, both to rich and poor under one roof. And it should be trustworthy and reproducible reports, which can be reviewed and challenged by anywhere outside this department or outside the hospital. Next objective will be to get recognition by CPSP, College of Physicians and Surgeons, for F FCPS training in radiology in this department and to support and facilitate research and audit activities, to establish regular MDM, which is multidisciplinary meetings with different modalities, different domains in the hospital, so we can discuss cases. And we have already started a discrepancy meeting in the department, which is a monthly event where we discuss all those cases which have come back for review. And these are anonymous meetings. This is not to name and blame people. This is just for our own learning in the department that we have established now. So we would like to continue to strive for quality anywhere in the world. We can offer in Shalama Hospital. Again, long list of interventional radiology in diabetic foot. We can offer angioplasty and stenting. We can offer thrombectomy, thrombolysis, CT guided procedures, chemotherapy, filters, so on and on. I think non-clinical uh, people won't be aware about these things, but uh, this is just a long list of interventional procedures which are offered on site in Shalama Hospital. Again, MRI, we can offer routine MRI scan, brain, spine. We can also offer perfusion imaging, MR spectroscopy, diffusion weighted imaging, and we can do MR angiography of different body parts, brain including legs, peripheral parts. We can offer MR enterography, which is a new modality to detect diseases of Crohn's and TB. MRCP, we are offering to detect CBD stones or tumors or pathology of bile ducts and pancreatic duct. We are offering MR dynamic for liver, pancreas, and endometrial carcinoma. Similarly, MR angiography of abdomen and MRI of breasts. We are offering all these services. CT scan, again, we are offering all sorts of CT imaging, including angiography and specialized CT examinations. Fluoroscopy, we are offering different procedures. Ultrasound is available. Intervention suite is here in the department. We have made a recovery area, which is a requirement overseas in UK or America to have recovery area in the radiology department. So whenever we're doing day case procedures, we can cater those within the radiology department under our direct supervision. So alhamdulillah, we have this recovery area, which is one of a kind in Pakistan. <coughs> so our uh, standards are within 24 hours, all imaging have to be reported, including CT MR scans, Ultrasound reports have to be issued within one hour, emergency reports as soon as possible. We are open to criticism and review by in-house and outside people. We are a transparent department. We want everything to be transparent. People should tell us about our weaknesses so we can have more strength. Discrepancy, I mentioned research audit, inshallah, we are going to start. So future will be recognition by CPSP for FCPS training. Because FC we are resident, they will raise the department profile, there will be more audit and search activities in the department. Inshallah intervention and geography suite. Hopefully we can get next fiscal year. These are a few pictures of our new department. This is our reception, quite straight out of the art background by the marketing department. The machines we have already shown you. This is all we have. These are pictures of new department waiting area reception, etc. Thank you very much for your time. I will request uh, Dr. Nizam to come and say a few words for us, please. Thank you, Zahir, for. Uh introducing your radiology department to the audience here. So nicely set stage. I'm so happy for you to have a beautiful uh, radiology set up. Everything is here. Now it's up to the clinicians, actually. That's what I'm more worried about. We have an F-16 in Shalimar Hospital. We have to use it like an F-16, not like a Jingji. As you said, the desires of the patients are to get the best out of the hospital. And the best out of the hospital is obviously given by the clinicians. 
I, being a radiologist and always working in radiology in my medical career, appreciate that we are an ancillary service always driven by our clinicians. So we need to have clinicians around us who are smart and able to utilize all the services which you have enlisted over here. It's most important that we establish MDTs, we establish a communication system in which they are lured into radiology. I would wish that they would spend more time in radiology than in their own units, trying to decipher what they're trying to get out of these images, explaining and, you know, uh, interacting with us, getting the questions answered by us. That's most important. Then I think I will feel more happy that what we have set up or the Board of Governors have invested into is really paying back. And, you know, that should be the way forward for us. As far as the equipment is concerned, I don't believe that there's anything beyond this which you could desire in a good radiology department at this stage anywhere in the world, frankly, for that matter. The MR which you're obviously boasting about is the, one of the best MRs in the world, for that matter. But it's only best when it's utilized to that level, not by just placing it into a division or a department and not taking uh, the extract out of it uh, as uh, it should happen. I think uh, the uh, room for development uh, as far as training is concerned is huge in this uh, institution. Uh, we need to bring forth the FCPS program. We need to even bring in the MCPS program so that uh, you know, we have good quality workers. Actually, this brings in more good workers into your department. So you will have good workers who you will train as a supervisor and obviously these people will then disseminate into the rest of the society and run other departments as good as this department should be eventually, inshallah. I hope this uh, investment and this desire and this mission which you have uh, taken on board is fulfilled in the very near future, I hope. Uh, I wish you all the best. Thank you. Thank you very much, uh, Dr. Najam. It is an honor to have you on our consultant uh, radiologist panel of experts. Uh, <clears throat> I would now uh, invite all of you for a visit of our radiology department. Uh, from here, we will proceed to the Shalama Radiology Center, and you will be guided by the ushers and the porters on the way uh, to the venue. And after this short tour, uh, we will proceed to the SMDC cafeteria uh, to be served with uh, sumptuous high tea. And uh, first of Shari all, Shari Mahaspatal in 30 crores, the new radiology block has been created in the new radiology block. The new radiology block has been created in the new radiology block.